As Carl kept himself busy over lockdown, he never realised his sketches would escape his personal confinement and be publicised in a book, and that his musings would become a project. It was probably late, late April, beginning of May 2021, that was when I sort of people started to ask me online, oh, I'd love to see a sketchbook, blah, 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 and I was thinking, well, why not? produce something from it. Um, originally it was going to be a zine, which is like a little, like a magazine sort of uh, cheap sort of paper-based book. But, um, but then there was so much demand and stuff, I thought, well, no, why don't we go a bit more upmarket with it? And the process continues with the pictures of Lockdown with Kenio on exhibition. These photos are all based by references pe that people sent to me of emotions or feelings or scenarios from the lockdown periods. Um, I think personally that all, because they weren't, they weren't done with the idea of selling them originally, um, I think they have a different essence uh, about them. Basically, I think that when someone views them, it may remind them of certain emotions that they may have gone through. A perfect example is the cathartic scream, the, the, the young girl um, screaming into her pillow, um, or the, the one with the, with the girl cutting her hair, you know, because those connections that I made with, with those individuals um, were quite special because those people were saying, you know, how many times I've, 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 I've done my makeup um, and, and for no reason because I'm staying at home or, or the, the girl that cut her hair, you know, um, so I think that, uh, and again, cut her hair, just because, you know, um, because you couldn't get it done outside. Um, so I think that th they can have that element of romanticism as well. Um, but there's also the serious side, um, the element of, 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 like, for example, like I mentioned before, the, the shouting into a pillow, punching into a pillow, um, s you know, s crying into a pillow. Um, how many of us, you know, have, have gone through that or, or may have gone through that? It's funny that you should say that because they weren't for sale. Do you think that when you know that something is for sale, it slightly inhibits your, yourself? Very good question. Um, I, I think that I'm not saying that when I, you know, when I do a piece of, of work like a landscape, um, you don't have that romantic side of it when you do it or that poetic justice. But the back of your head, I mean, you sometimes think, well, this one perhaps is more sellable. But these never ever were probably going to leave my sketchbook uh, apart from maybe you know the posts online on instagram or on facebook these were just gonna it's a sad but maybe die in the sketchbook but um it was because of sort of the 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 the, the uh, feedback that i got from them that it decided to sort of have give them a, a new lease of life um so yeah yeah i guess so i suppose the exhibition is one of two halves with a series of landscapes also on view it would be up at the Fine Arts Gallery in Casements till the 4th.